The real experiencing stops because your attention is so much muddled up. So on one side if you move, on the left hand side, your attention is muddled up with fear, with pain, with unhappiness, with hopelessness, dejection. The other side, if you indulge too much onto the right hand side, little bit also, you start getting elated, excited, over dominate. The color of the left side is blue and the blue color starts changing to the black. While on the right hand side it is to begin with yellow, light yellow or you can say golden, then yellow, then orange and then red. So you go to aggression on the right hand side. On the left hand side you go into a complete state of entropy you can call it, or a state where you are separated from yourself into complete frozen state. So one side you become completely frozen, on the other side you become completely heated up. Both these things are again movement on the wrong direction. Even in the center when the attention is kept, that you keep your attention more in the center. There also, because it's a very sensitive point, it doesn't stay there. For example, when we say use fire, we can use it for burning the house. In the same way we can use it for creating smoke. But we can also use this fire in its proper way if we use it in its proper proportion for cooking the food, for giving us light. If it is too much, it can burn like a big fire. If it is too little, it can burn like smoke. But in the center, when you know how to balance it, then you can use it for your own purpose, for cooking or for giving light. And then for a puja too. So in the same way, when we really balance our gunas properly, then we become gradually the master of the whole situation. The attention doesn't get dragged into things that we have been doing or that we have understood through our memories or through our experiences or whatever it is and is not also dragged towards too much on the right hand side that we try to overpower or try to do, dominate someone. Because if you move too much that side, you have seen, it becomes blood. It is difficult for people to understand how when people become very religious minded, like now Iran, The movement is on the right, all the austerities, all that, everything. Now, bloodshed. Christians also did the same. Brahmins did the same in India. Buddhists did the same. Even they talked of non-violence, they got to bloodshed. Because movement started right hand side. Left hand side movement will take you to very sly and dark methods. So right-handed sided people like big nations who are supposed to be developed nations, they justify war. We must have weapons to face each other. But you all each other are the same people from God's point of view. Why are you fighting? I mean God asks you, why are you fighting? What is the need? Why don't you sit down properly and listen to each other? What are you fighting about? 
you are fighting about land is it your father's land it belongs to god god has created this land why are you fighting but your attention is such that immediately you think, oh this is my land this is my mother land this is my father land this is my brother land but what about your land which is within you is not your own so if you go on telling these people that we should have no war they will not listen realization is the only way by realization your attention gets higher and gets separated from that strata from where these things bubble in you understand my point now 